Good morning and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this morning with Tyson and Fred and what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Tyson's ability to understand and respond to his formal obedience commands. The little corrections and the motivation that we give the dogs when we're working with them and the training equipment that we're using. Fred is using a regular six foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of the leash folded in his right hand. That leaves the left hand free to give the correction. And the only correction that we give here at school is a little tug and let go on the training collar. And that is the second piece of equipment that we're using. Tyson's gonna come home with his very own training collar and you'll be taught how to use that properly for all different types of problem behaviors that you are having in the home, not just formal obedience. Now, if you notice, Tyson is sitting very nicely at Fred's left which is where all of our obedience training is done. And the first exercise that they're gonna demonstrate for us is healing. The command is Tyson heal, and at this point Tyson has a job to do. And that is loose leash walking. And each time that Fred stops his feet, Tyson should sit automatically without being told to wait for his next command. So this makes walking your little guy a pleasure when you stop to cross traffic or stop to talk to a neighbor. He should be sitting quietly at your left and waiting for his next command. And he's doing a great job. Perfect automatic sit. Now the next exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is the stay. The stay is a hand and a voice command and it is a one word command. Flat of your left palm and the one word firm command to stay. The long sit stay when you're practicing at home should be for one minute working up to three minutes and you should practice indoors as well as outdoors. When Fred returns back to him, he walks all the way around him as an additional distraction and Tyson should remain seated until he gets a little pat for praise and another command and Fred told him to heal again and off they go. Nice automatic sets. We're limited here with the snow as to where we can video, so we kept the driveway available. Stay. Nice stay command, one word command. And remember, everywhere you practice with him is where you're going to get good behavior. So practice indoors as well as outdoors. This time, instead of returning back to him, Fred calls him in, he lightens his tone of voice, and Tyson should come in and sit right in front of Fred facing his knees, and then go back to heel and back sitting. That was very good. He's a sweet little guy, he's a good boy, he's got a lot of potential. Now if he doesn't sit, you heard Fred say no sit, and gave him a little tug on that training collar as a reminder. He leaves him in another sit stay. He's going to use his name and a happy voice and call him right in front and praises him on the way in. So he always recognizes that coming to you is a good thing to do. Now we're going to get ready to do our down commands and there are two of those. The first one is a down from heel position. So with your dog seated at your left. You take your left open palm, push it straight down toward the ground and give the one word command to down. And then you tell him to stay. Usually the long down stay is for three minutes, working up to five minutes. And again, you can practice this right in your home. You don't have to go outside to do these commands. When Fred returns back to him, he will walk all the way around him just as he did on the sit stay. As an additional distraction, and Tyson knows not to get up until he gets another command. <laughs> the little short legs. They're going to demonstrate that down from a heel again. Stay. <laughs> Tyson's got his own version of the down. I don't know if you can see that back leg up in the air. And this time, instead of returning back to him, Fred will call him out of that. And he praises him on the way in, praises him when he gets there, and then they go back to heel and back sitting. Very nice. And the very last exercise that we're going to be demonstrating for you will be your down from a distance. 
And this is good that Tyson's working out here with traffic and the distractions. Fred left him in a sit-stay. He'll use his right hand to give the command and he gives him the down from the end of the leash. That is your down from a distance. <laughs> now we've demonstrated for you his healing, his automatic sits, his stays, his down, his down from a distance, and his come. These are the exercises that we're going to be showing you how to put into practical application in your everyday living situations. He has been a joy to have. He's really a nice little guy. And thank you for choosing Nora's Dog Training Company.